Resume expedition. Yep, and it will always start you out in um, the starting point here. There's also something very fun you could see right here, pretty much every time if you pay a close. Like, you have to do it a few times to notice, usually, but... What, that? The thing that always skips off the face of that planet? Well, it's the always bit. It occasionally does not... It does th things a little differently every single time, actually. Well, I didn't notice that. It takes a while to notice, since it... I think it actually randomizes each time to some degree. Alright. Well, better not waste time. Well, I mean... They're sometimes used to that. Alright, so I went to the first two planets already, and I went to the moon of this planet. Yep. Wait, which two planets do you mean? You went to, um... I went to the two that are attached to each other. Oh, yeah. Ash Twin and Ember Twin. Well, I could recommend some, but I honestly really want to see where you'd go next. Where's the moon? Is that the moon? No, that's not the moon. Oh, there's the moon. Okay. I really don't want to Does crash also... into the moon while I'm, like, checking on something. Yeah, crashing into the moon is not great. I've been hit by planets before. It's not super fun. Oh, Lord. Come on. Come on. There. All right, now, can I... Trust myself to not wreck while I go look at this. Wait, are you out in the space? Out in space right now? No, oh, I'm in the. Well, I got out of the cockpit and I went to go look at the monitor. The ship's it depends. log. Uh, if you're in the ship's log, I think you're safe. But yeah, this this ship log I think is actually one of the things I I sort of feel is really brilliant about how this game operates, as the it's the way it kind of functions to sort of help you remind you of things, and the fact that it lets the game provide just a faint amount of interpretation. It's like, even if maybe you wouldn't have gotten exactly what they wanted you to get, you know, they can basically rely on the fact that the game will, the game has like a little bit of uh, ability to sort of, uh, well, interpret it for you to some degree. There's so many things to check out. Oh yeah. It's a lot there. I think I want to do, I think I might do, what was this one again? One of, uh, sure. one of three Nomai escape pods that crashed in our solar system. All three escape pods were launched from something called the Vessel, which is badly damaged. There's more to explore here. Chert has set up their astronomy gear on the north pole of Ember Twin. Chert has spotted an unusually high number of supernova. The Nomai survivors who crashed on Ember Twin decided to seek shelter in the caves beneath their crash escape pod. Chert thinks the lack of surface ruins means the Nomai must have lived somewhere underground. Yeah, see, I don't really know what I can do with that. Well... So it does not give any locations, right? Well, this one does. It says, A Namai named Calais mysteriously vanished from a cave at the bottom of the dry lake bed at Ember Twins' North Pole. So I could go there. True. Although at this point, you're also in a position of, like, you basically could explore any place and probably find more stuff, as you found those clues mostly just checking people, uh, places out randomly. Yeah. So yeah, you could either chase the clues down or just go to new places and try to find new clues, too. I mean, honestly, I actually think either one could work. Hmm. Where's that white hole at? Now, you could fly towards the white hole. That's also quite possible. I will. You can't stop me. No, but I'm having to stop myself from telling you um, a really big secret about how it works. Because I think you're going to lose your shit when you find out uh, one of the small elements related to it. Well, it's a black, it's a white hole, and I don't exactly know how those work, but I do know that they're theoretical, and I also can't lock onto it, it seems. Mm hmm For some reason, it's not letting me... You know, what's yeah, creepy about it is that I can't, I can't actually tell how close I am to it either, which is also very terrifying. Like, I can't tell if it's right in front of me, or if, I, if I'm still, like, a ways away, you know? Maybe the, uh, the things around it you can lock onto? No. And I can't tell how large those are, either. 
Now you gotta be careful as you approach it, I guess. I just noticed this little thing here that's actually telling me what I'm doing. That's cool. The oh, the uh, the, the thing that shows you what directions you're. Yeah, it's it's lighting up in. there. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, it's a really useful little trick. You also may notice it has like um, like thick multiple thick bars on each one. Oh no, actually, I th I'm thinking the wrong thing. Yeah, still can you give you some indication of how hard you're pushing every direction too. If you're actually playing with it like a uh, controller, you can e it'll even show you like degrees of how much power you're throwing into it. Oh my god, look how close I am to this fucking thing. Maybe I should check out Dark Bramble instead. I mean, in theory, wouldn't a white hole be, like, not as dangerous as a black hole? I, I say... I don't exactly know... How well, is. I, I don't know what a white hole is. I, I still think that they're... I've only heard theories about what they are, and I don't really know what they really are. Actually, I know where the, I know where this is. This is that one thing that you streamed for me, I think, where you went in here and those... No, wait, no, maybe this isn't it. Hmm. You streamed something for me once where those giant anglerfish were inside, and you were, like, terrified by it. So you did spoil that, that for familiar. me. You did spoil I that. I did, yes. But I think that was on that water planet, and maybe not this. But it does look like this. Yeah, I did warn Zar about that ahead of time, although I may have lied to her slightly about how big the anglerfish were, since I didn't want her to quit. Oh, this is it. I remember. And those white dots are them, isn't it? Mm -hmm. They might be. Yeah, I know they are. I'm not crazy. I remember what you told me. I remember watching. Yeah, maybe. Oh, by the way, do you know your ship can actually fire a, a uh, scouter? Uh, Just as a equip scout totally launcher thing? This is like, it says I can equip a, equip a scout yeah. launcher. Try it. I mean, if you don't want to, if you want to check something out ahead of time, you can fire a scouter at it. Come on, can I just get completely? Here we go. Uh, snapshot. There we go. See. You can scout ahead, so you don't have to worry about uh, seeing. I don't see yeah. anything, though. It's all white. Well, there is that, too. But that probably means there's nothing there. I mean, again, I, I think I told you this. The first time I flew through there, I uh, did not kn I didn't run into one, and I didn't actually know they were there. How come when I, throw, how come when I shoot one this way, it goes like that? Is that a bug? Like, oh. Nope. There's a good reason for that. I would say you need to click the button faster to see what ha why it suddenly changed area. Damn, that's quick, though. It is. But that also means you're very close to it. There's nothing. There is a reason. Oh, my God. It should be quite visible, actually, if you're close enough to it. Oh, my God. What's the red dot? I'm not sure why you're so afraid of dying. It's not like you, it's forever. I can't tell how far away the red dot is, damn it. Yeah, it's intentionally pretty, like, disorienting, isn't it? It is. At least I warned you it's in here. I Again, I didn't know, and even worse, I explored it once, like, for an entire cycle, and nothing happened. Like, I didn't run into any of the fish. So the second time I went in, I was convinced it was totally fine. I thought it was just like every other fucking part of the game where there's nothing there trying to kill you. Oh, So God. I suddenly, like, you know, I'm tooling around like nothing's happening and all of a sudden, munch. Well, I'm getting real close to this red thing, whatever it is. I think you're mo- I don't think it's gonna immediately kill you. I mean, I know how Back anglerfish to... work. The thing dangles in front of their mouths, so it, you know... Yeah. That's how an anglerfish... That is how the anglerfish, anglerfish do. do. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I told you I'm not going to narrate the poop. <laughs> it's a good system. For a little more room between the, uh... The even the pooping for me. Fuck. Ah, there's something. Slap! Okay, okay, so that actually did something. Oh, you found a thing? What is that? Oh, well, 
you know how your thing changed location suddenly? Yeah, is that why? Possibly. Is it like a teleporter? Maybe. Again, you should go closer and find out. I'm working on it. Shut up. You're trying to get me scared. Would I do that? Yes. Only because I take so much enjoyment out of watching you pee your pants when you're trying to play, I don't know, something as fun and silly as Resident Evil 2. I was gonna say, yeah, I, I think I actually, I can't be blamed here considering the way you tend to behave with me when I get the shit scared out of me. Hey, I've played the Five Nights at Freddy's games. That's more than I can say for you. I don't know. Oh, hi. Oh, that's a fucking death trap in there then, isn't it? What are you taking oh, you for? Fired one, you fired one in? Look at this. What kind of madman would go in there? <laughs> You're gonna have to eventually, I think. Says who? Like, not now, but I mean, like, you know, eventually in the future, possibly. Well, they don't seem attracted to the... Oh, whoa. Oh, what is that? That's new. Ooh, yes. Yes, it is. The anglerfish don't seem to care about my camera flying through. What is that? That is an excellent question, and something I actually was very curious about, too. Neat though, isn't it? I wonder if there's any other way to get in there to it, other than this direction. Probably not. So Dark, Br Dark Bramble is a very confusing place at first, and I should warn you, uh, there are quite a few areas of the game where you find answers about one area in different areas. So, you know, again, not to say you should stop exploring. This, this thing is cool. so much bigger on the inside than it lets on to be. Like, this oh, little it is. Yeah, thing it is... Oh, it physics. Elsie, you see the duplicate signal error? Yeah. Wonder what that means. Or how that works. It seems like no matter what angle I go in, like the anglerfish are always in the same spot, no matter which direction I look at this from. Well, I mean, I think I told you before, the game is kind of like, it runs on a, a timer of sorts. So every time you start again, everything is always in the same, the same spot. Oh, uh, there's another one then. So that's what that is. But what are you? You're an anglerfish, aha. Fuck you, asshole. And what are you? You're another bramble thingy, okay, got it. This place is weird and spoopy. Yeah, it's it's interesting to see. Like, it's not a horror game, but it it effectively makes you sit there and actually feel a little bit nervous about what's going on. I'm left to wonder if there are any of these angler fish that don't have visual cues. You know, visual cues. How do you mean? Like, they don't have a light. Did the ones you saw have lights? Well, they've all got these I little. Don't remember. They've all got these white lights that tip me off that they're there. Oh, okay, yeah. It's the, literally the definition of an angler fish, isn't it? I don't think all those white lights you saw earlier were anglerfish, though. Like, well, yeah, I mean, th th like right? this this one's not. This is a... This is this. See? So I know this isn't yeah. an anglerfish. But I'm willing to bet that if I try to go in here, it's going to be the same as the other one. Quite possibly. Oh, there's... Ooh, there's a red light in this one. Okay. Hold on. Um, okay, so, no anglerfish, question mark? TM, no, and no anglerfish TM? Uh, what are you, you're moving, uh oh, I don't like that. Wait, are you moving? I can't tell Relic because it keeps teleporting my shit. It keeps you're firing it through the things. All right, I'm just gonna go. I feel like something's pushing my ship around in here. And turn around and find there's an anglerfish behind just nudging you along. Oh god. Something... Am I bouncing off the walls? What's going on? Maybe I am. You can bounce off stuff. You None of your ship's damaged, right? No. Oh yeah, then you're probably just bouncing off uh, stuff. Uh, 
Oh god, this is creepy as hell. Listen, they're more scared of you than you are of them. I doubt it. I really strongly doubt that. Okay, that's an anglerfish. Listen. Got it. People always told me that about spiders and never believed them, so, you know, just passing along that trauma. Again, though, like, not to minimize your experience, but I, god is damn, like, Is that I, moving? Or am I moving? Oh, there are, there is a thing in here that's moving, yeah. I think that thing is rotating slowly. Yeah, I can, I can guarantee you that one. There is that thing rotating. Okay, and that's an anglerfish, too. Okay, so those are both anglerfish, but if I just creep forward towards the red guy here, I'm thinking I'll be okay. Well, I have to wait for this jackass to make his rotation again. There's nothing here. It's just a red dot. Oh, check your signal scope out. I can't even get off this. I can't even get out of my ship, can I? You, you, you can use your signal scope from inside the ship. Uh, it's not picking up anything. Oh wait, maybe I I'm... meant to use the right one. Quantum fluctuations? No. Well, I've only got quantum fluctuations and hide and seek. Hide and seek? Oh, yeah, you haven't gotten the other ones yet. That's right. Might be wasting my time here, then, huh? Well, maybe, but I wouldn't say necessarily. Again, honestly, like... There really isn't any wasting your time, at least yeah, I'm learning. early on. Yeah, you're, you're picking stuff up as you go. So there it but is the again, is, right there. The game is very non-linear, and you're gonna... There's a lot of stuff in here, I'm pretty sure, that basically is gonna be like, you're... You won't understand it now, but later on, you'll find stuff that will suddenly make sense of a lot of it. Like, that was at least my experience. I don't know what you are, Mr. Red Dot. Uh oh, oh, uh oh, wait. Oh, yes, those can also be the seeds like that. Oh, God, this is this one again. There's no fucking way I can go through here. Well, you can. Not a good idea, but you could. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I can't see where they are. Okay, now I can kind of... Ah, no! Don't do it, don't do it! Back up, yeah, back up, Yeah, I think up. you might want... Yeah, I think backing up may be a decent move. How do you sneak through there? I was hardly even... Oh, do you have to really just be that... Oh, wow, look how... What? I just backed right out of the whole damn place? Just like that? That easy? Yeah, seems so. I thought I was further in than that. Was I not? I was further in than that, wasn't I? You were. And then when I came out, it kicked me all the way back out to here. Mm-hmm. This place is kind of interesting creepy. how that works, isn't it? Yeah. Ow. Yeah. Oops. Dark Bramble is a weird fucking place. Like it's it's faintly upsetting. Oh, and. Oh, you gotta get out and repair? I'm going to, I guess. Right, you said, yeah. Just for the heck of it. Plus, I like this area. I haven't got to... I haven't got to look at it yet. Wow, this is actually... Oh, this is one of those... Isn't this one of those gravity snow? What? Hello? Okay. I swear... Is that the wait, interloper? Wait. Yeah, that's the interloper. Wow, I didn't realize it came that close.
there's there's that. On this one, you can't even tell. Like, look, you see how I'm moving left and right? Yep. Like, if you look up, you like unless there's like something in your frame of reference to tell you that you're moving left and right, you can't even tell that you're like. If I look up right now, you can't tell that I'm moving. Yeah. I'm, I'm moving left. And it's really disorienting. You mean like moving left across the surface of the planet? Yeah, like, mean, like like moving left or right, like right here. You can't tell that I'm doing it from down here. Oh yeah. Because there's no frame of reference. Yeah, the frame of reference issues in this game are, like... I mean, they made it work, but goddamn, it was complicated by the sound of things. I hadn't really thought about that, actually, when I was playing it. Is there nothing on this planet at all? On this one? What is this? Uh, oh, you found that one. There's nothing on it. Yeah, strange about that, huh? Wait, where'd it go? Also an excellent question. Is that whole planet made out of that same shit from before that goes away if you don't look at it? Fascinating suggestion. That seems like the only solution. What the fuck? It disappeared. <laughs> Come back. Come on. I'm not looking. I'm looking. Something tells me that I shouldn't have looked away from it and just jumped right for the fucking thing and tried to go to it. Well, maybe. But I mean, honestly, again, like, early on, the fact there that it you're is. already making guesses about it. Come back. I'm gonna fly to this thing. I don't care. Well, I may not be able to make it, but I'm gonna try. Oh, yeah, that'd be... Oh, yeah. God I damn it, I looked down. Fuck. Now it's gone. <laughs> well, my time's almost up anyways. Wait, there it is. It's super far away now. Ah, so Ow! My legs. That didn't feel good. Legs. I landed on this thing from like <laughs> 20 feet in the air. And I hurt myself. My time is almost up, although the music isn't playing yet. Also, am I fucking insane? Or did this massive planet here come out of nowhere? Which planet's that? Hey! Wait! Oh, come back! What are you doing? Ship! Hello? Is ship getting sucked around on this thing? Ship! Oh! Oh, shit! Wait, why is your ship suddenly getting sucked off the planet? Ship! I don't know! What is this? Where did this giant fucking planet come from? Uh, can you target it all? Oh, I know which planet that is. It's not a planet that I should have. It's oh, is that the is that the water planet? Yep. It's the gas giant of the system. Kind of. It looks cool as hell from back here when it's eclipsing the sun. Of course, it's gonna completely hide the uh, end of the game or the end of the cycle for me. And there's that son of a bitch. Gone. Wait, is that it again? No. Oh my god, there's always something. And this thing here's been flying around for a while, too. But I, that may just be debris, I don't know. Yeah, that may be. I, I honestly don't remember that one. Wait, what? Is that the white hole? Why is it so far away now? Wait, what planet are you on right now? Are you still on Dark Bramble? Look at how far... Uh, I'm above it, yes. It's below me. I'm, like, standing on the patch of ice that's above it. Okay. Look so at that, how far oh, away the black planet. hole is, or the white hole is now. Yeah. Holy I think that shit. Moves. Or no, Dark Bramble does rote does actually have an orbit. Maybe you're being pulled away from it really fast because Dark Bramble's orbit's moving you away from it. Oh, I was gonna hit F9 to take a screenshot, but that cancel the recording. Uh that always looks so cool. This has such a Majora's Mask feel to it. Yeah, again, that was one of the reasons I kind of figured this might be a game you'd really get into. I love space. I love Majora's Mask. Yeah. Combine them both. How could you not love it? I was actually also just talking to Czar in the background, mentioning the, uh, <clears throat> the sort of the differences in watching the two of you play this game at first. 
And one of the most interesting bits is Zar is a, you know, science fiction kind of nut to some degree, I guess. Grew up watching Star Trek and shit like that. So early on, I was kind of impressed that she guessed a lot of the um, the sort of plot points to the game pretty quick. Mm -hmm. She didn't know if they were right or not, but she at least guessed that they might be occurring. And she noticed one or two weird sort of like tropey bits in the game. But I was noting that you seem to be picking up on a lot of the actual space phenomena and, you know, implications of those a lot faster. I think your space interests have served you well in that regard. I don't know what you are, but I'm coming for you. Oh, white hole? No, this purple thing. Well, you can just keep gaining speed, by the way. In fact, I was going to say, um, there is a, uh... There is a there is and one this puzzle is to go further beyond. Sorry, you can catch it, at least at sometimes if you're fast enough. But um, there is a uh, sorry kitty. What aligning flight trajectory a... returning to solar system? Aww. Oh yeah, you may have flown too far out, or the angle may have been wrong this time. Damn. But uh, there is a um, a specific puzzle in the game that normally requires you to have figured out a bunch of specific stuff and to do a very specific thing to, to sort of break a barrier that you have to get through. Yeah. But the, um, the devs apparently found out after the fact that if you just go really, really fast, then you can technically break through the barrier without having to do any of the other stuff. No. But you, you have to get... You, have, you know, like when you're approaching a, a planet, you can get up like a few hundred or even a few thousand meters a second? Yeah. You have to be at something like 20 or I think 20,000 meters a second uh, travel time in reference to this thing to, to pull it off. Ah. Which means you basically have to wait until the, the thing you're aiming at is, at is at a sort of an outer edge of the galaxy and you have to be at the other end of the galaxy and you have to just gun it. It's also not super, you know, uh, easy to do. But the devs actually said they left the glitch uh, in because they thought it was cool. What about this? Wait, no. How do I... How do I view the, the solar system, like, from above? I did that before. Um, um, I think it was a different part of your ship, wasn't it? Like, that thing up there, maybe? No, no, maybe not. There was a way to view... I think it was your computer there, actually. The orbits, like, in it as a whole. Um, rumor mode Z? No, that's no, not that, that brings it. Oh wait, maybe map. No wait, no, that takes it back. Map mode just goes back to this. There was a way to view that though, wasn't there? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I don't know, let me see here. I'll look it up. Is it this? Do I have to zoom out? No, that's not it. Hmm. 